Hello, I am Dr. Belen G. Himutao. I will be discussing to you about phonemic awareness. But before that, let us review the sound of letters in the alphabet with emphasis on the keywords, name that begins in the letter sound. A is for a, a, apple. B is for p, p, boy. C is for k, k, cat. D is for t, t, doll. E is for e, e, elephant. F is for f, f, father. G is for g, g, goat. H is for hammer. I is for E, E, insect. J is for J, J, jet. K is for K, K, kite. L is for L, L, lollipop. M is for M, M, monkey. O is for O, O, octopus. P is for P, P, pen. Q is for Q, Q, question. R is for R, R, rat. S is for S, S, sun. T is for T, T, tiger. U is for A, A, umbrella. V is for v, v, van. W is for wallet. X is for x, x, x ray. Y is for y, y, yellow. Z is for z, z, zebra. There are two types of consonant phonemes. The first one is continuous sounds. Continuous sounds are sounds that can be pronounced for several seconds without any distortion. Example, Stop sounds are sounds that can be pronounced for only an instant. It is very important to avoid adding a uh to stop sound as it is pronounced which confuses the students. Example. I, k, 
Why phonemic awareness is important? First of all, phonemic awareness performance is a strong predictor of long-term reading and spelling success. Phonological awareness is an umbrella term that includes for developmental levels. The first one is word awareness. For example, black, board. When we combine black plus board, we form black board. Syllable awareness. Example, pen, sil, two syllables. Mother, two syllables. On onset rhyme awareness, onset, Rhyme at. When we combine k at, the word is cat. The last is phonemic awareness. What is phonemic awareness? Phonemic awareness is the understanding that spoken language words can be broken into individual phonemes. Phonemes is the smallest unit of sound in a word. Let us watch the videos on phonemes. Ah. 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 B. 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 B.
There are four basic essential phonemic awareness. The first one is phoneme identification. Phoneme identification is the ability to recognize the same sounds in different words. Example, man, map, mail. What sound is the same in all the words? The answer is M. Mm. Another example. Cat. Can. Cap. What sound is the same in all the words? The answer is A. Eh. Another example. Hop. Sip, lip. What sound is the same in all the words? The answer is p. The next basic skill in phonemic awareness is phoneme isolation. What is phoneme isolation? Phoneme isolation is the ability to identify specific phonemes in words. Example, fan, fan. The first sound is f. The last sound is n. Another example, dog, dog. The first sound is d. D. The last sound is g, g, g. Another example, man. The first sound is m. The last sound is n. The third basic phonemic awareness skill is phoneme blending. What is phoneme blending? Phoneme blending is the ability to blend individual sounds into a word. Example, s, e, t, sit. Next, s, t, ah, p, stop. Next, m, mm, a, ah, s, t, must. Next, sh, sh, a, ah, p, shia. The fourth basic phonemic skill is phon phoneme segmenting. What is phoneme segmenting? Phoneme segmenting is the ability to break words down into individual sounds. For example, sand, s, a, n, d. Another example, ship, sh, e, p. Next, Chin, ch, e, n. I will give you some guidelines for teaching phonemic awareness. Use the critical features of effective instruction. Explicit instruction is critical because struggling readers, including students with reading disabilities, tend to have poor phonemic awareness. Explicit phonemic awareness instruction is recommended before and during reading instruction for struggling readers. Next, model its activity when it is first introduced 
by demonstrating how to say different sounds as students watch the formation of their mouth. Students can use small mirrors to watch their own mouths as they practice. You can use the videos which I have presented before as your basis. Moreover, assess each student individually because phonemic awareness is a predictor of early reading achievement. Assessment of phonological awareness enables early identification of students who are at risk for difficulty in learning to read. Finally, start with a simple consonant sounds. These are the following consonant sounds that the teacher must begin to teach. Example, mmm, er, mmm, Once again, this is Dr. Belenji Himutau leaving you this very important quotation. Reading is the primary avenue to knowledge. Enjoy learning!